Hey guys, Ryan here from Amazing RC. So I'm cracking a iced tea can open. And I haven't made this video in a while. And here you see the poor, poor wrestler. Now, up, oh, nah. So, obviously you can tell, body completely destroyed. Uh, let's see. I don't even know. But every, obviously the entire, everything's taken apart. So, I mean, truck's done. Or is it? As you can see, I did hook up the fan for the speed controller, or for the uh, motor. Just... The box. Yes, yes, that is a box. The box contains... It's okay, no boxes were harmed. The making of this film, no boxes were harmed. You do not need to be worried. <laughs> Alright, so, I just mentioned my body is destroyed. New body, you sort of see it, can't really. But, paints I'm gonna use is Tamiya PS dash four blue and PS dash five black. Um these are made for buck sand bodies and for a gearbox. Entergy, yeah I know it's bad. No one likes Entergy stuff really, but I don't know. I'll try it out. Alright, so shall we rebuild it? I think we should. Okay, so first we'll take the body off. Um, this little wing, this is actually for to me an F1 car. I don't know if I'm gonna put it back on. Maybe. Let me know if I should. So this was the gearbox I had, the RPM hyper gearbox. Didn't work. So, we got the entry one. This one I can also, sorry for the camera show, this one I can also put the fan on without having to do any modifications. Took this open. Sorry, I keep stepping on the thing for the camera. I'm an idiot. Now, I'm not going to show you really everything I'm doing because it's going to take forever. I'll show it to you quick. Some extra hardware. Gearbox itself. I don't even know if you guys can see the shine of that. Oh, oh yeah. That's just amazing. So, to get into it, four screws. Oh, uh, while you get into it. So, and they are full of set. Drill really low torque rating so you don't strip anything out.
we're all the same size screws. Now you're into it. Now let's. Now that just looks bloody amazing. So, switch gears out and then I'll be back. And it is put all back together. Uh, so. Alright. So, I don't know, that's gonna look pretty nice. Oh yeah, that's gonna look great. Alright, so. Uh, I will get the gearbox on and come back. So I decided I'd tell you guys what I want to do as far as the body. So, get this body open. Out back. Body, stickers, some more stickers, some hardware, and a wing. Sorry, I had to go do something real quick. So, I'm gonna do black body, blue stripe up the mill. Yeah. Let's go get started on the masking. Alright. Oh my god, I'm having so many issues. Alright. Um. Paint's out drying. I think you guys will like it. So. I put the gearbox on, as you can see. Gearbox on. Just so I. Start working on the rest of this. So, next thing I have to do is put the shock tower back on. Which is actually usually, surprisingly enough, one of the hardest parts. Only because it never works. put these in. Always try to do it. So. Just, oh. So we screwed into the gearbox first.
my god. Oh. I'll be back. Alright, I got the thing. Uh. Um, what's it called? I got the screw out. That is stripped. I'm great. Now I'm gonna put the camera links back on. If you guys do a lot of car maintenance, I would like, well, RC car maintenance, obviously. I definitely get one of these uh, stands because they're very useful. And they spin just that easy. Camera links are on. Alright, so I'm going to put the shocks on, the motor back in. Well, I'll put the shocks on. Put the shock, yeah, I'll just put the shocks on quick. And then I'm going to put the motor in off camera to see my body is. I'll come back when the body's all done. Everything put back together. And yep. So let's get the shocks on. Shocks, tracks the little numb caps. I think it's funny, none of the aluminum I have on on this truck. None of them match. They are all just one a tiny bit different shade. I mean you guys way. That's just brilliant. I might actually have to replace my shock shoes. Shock, my shock shoes. My so shock soon. Because I'm beginning to bend them. And that's not a good thing. Bending my shocks. There's one side on. So, now that I, well, well, I'm assuming most of you know how this uh, most you know how 
how this truck works. If you don't know what the truck is, it's a Traxxas Russer. Um, it was a VXL. Put a castle system in it. My sister's boyfriend actually smashed into a wall. Gave it to me. I put the castle system in it and all those upgrades. So, trust me, there's plenty more to come. Alright guys, I'll be back when I have the motor on. Alright guys, and that's from the old body. So, wheelie bar, please note if you get this Intergy wheelie bar, or Intergy gearbox, you cannot use this wheelie bar. You're, well, you can use it, you just have to make some kind of modification so it can actually mount. Because there's no way you can mount it to the um, gearbox. So, that's what it used to look like. It's the old body. So it used to look like orange paint scheme. Now, See, it's all cracking and now behold the savage killer <laughs> oh boy this came out amazing Traxxas Rustler wings all blue the blue line up the middle. Add a little bit of uh, coloring there and up here. That looks mean. The whole inside's blue. This, my friends, is a mean truck. Badlands. Pro One Badlands. I'd recommend getting these. Best up. One of the one of the best offer tires, not the best. Uh, well, it could be. I'm gonna. Uh, my friends are have it. Um, see here. I have the Badlands. One of my other friends has the Mashers. Or he's he just ordered the Mashers. And my other friend's getting the Trenchers. Well, has the Trenchers. All of the two point eight. Theirs are stampedes. Um, the one has the trenchers has a VXL, so it's the brushless version. However, the one that's getting the mashers is the only brushed. So we're gonna cycle the tires between different trucks, see how they react, and yeah. Now most of you guys are looking at the body, the VXL, and saying, "Why don't you just switch the mashers?" Well, you just switch to mashers and trenchers, because this and the stampede are the same. Well, they're not. This, I'll normally run a 3S lipo. I'm only, I'm only using this 2S. It's actually a pretty nice battery. So, yeah. Castle system, but... Alright, guys. Truck's done. See you guys next time. And... Yeah, let me know how you think.